right, so we're working on the fireplace hearth. So we've got the tar paper down, and then Perry got this mold. See your mold? It's supposed to put a rough edge on it. So we'll see how that works out. So it'll be all the way around. And then I kind of, it's going to be made out of concrete and I want it to look like a, a stone so I didn't want it perfectly straight. I wanted curves to it and bumps. And then we set the, set the level up here and made it level to the back side and I put a piece of tape. So then we could just follow the top of the concrete to that. And then it should have about, uh, hopefully a half an inch to an inch overhang. All right. Next he's going to go and start mixing up the concrete. All right. So he's got his concrete mixture and he's adding some fiberglass shavings to help make it stronger. So he's using the secrete sand mix topping and bedding. And he's mixing that fiberglass in really well, getting it all over. And now we can add the water and slowly mix that in. This is going to be the longest part of this job, getting all this mixed together well. Alright, this is looking pretty good. It's not too soupy and it's not too dry. I think it's ready to start to take it into the house and use it. So we are dividing it into two buckets to help carry it into the house. And Perry carries it in because it's a little heavy for me. And now he's dumping it into the mold. And that's looking really nice. Now this is our first time creating a hearth for a fireplace. So this is all new and trial and error and see how it works out. Fingers crossed it works out good. So while he is starting on the next one, I am smoothing out this batch and tapping the edge, trying to make sure it gets into all the nooks and crannies. And I'm just smoothing it out and filling it up as much as I can. Now this is one bag. And here you can see how it plops nicely. It kind of sounds like a cow patty. That's a nice consistency. It makes it nice and easy to maneuver. And smooth out. We're getting closer to the end. So this is the last bag of the pre-mixed concrete. Looks like we'll be just a little short so Perry will have to mix it the concrete and sand together for the last little bit. But it's all looking nice. Getting it nice and smooth. And packed down. Trying to make sure all the air bubbles are out. And it's all settled and nice. Fun part is trying to smooth it out as smooth as I can. It definitely took a few tries, but eventually it turned out pretty good. 
as the water worked its way up, it made it a lot easier to smooth it out. Now once this all dries and sets for a few days, we'll be able to take the mold off and I'm going to stain it a brown color. I hope you enjoyed our video today. Stay tuned for the final reveal in a, one of the upcoming videos. Please make sure to subscribe, like, and click the notification bell. Thank you.